You may recognize me from literally all of the bottoming videos on YouTube and all of the gay educational videos, but you may not have seen some recent ones for a while and there's actually a reason. So welcome back to my channel, everyone. It's Stephen Brennan here with another YouTube video. And in today's video, we're going to talk about why I had to take a little break from filming all these gay educational videos. And let's just have a little catch up as well because it's been so long and I'm so happy to finally be able to film a video and speak to all of you. So before we get into the video, if you haven't already, please remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel and check out all my socials at Stephen Brendan and also my OnlyFans, which I'm going to be a lot more active on. And I've actually just released 100 subscriptions with discounts on. So you can check the link in the description of this YouTube video for all of my external links. Now, as we all know, I have filmed so many gay educational videos, but I had to take a break for several reasons. One being, I was just not really happy over the past couple of months, like, internally and i've been making some life decisions and i've actually decided to go ahead and leave spain to film a video in spain in barcelona is really hard because yes i just sit down in my room and i film a video but the walls here are so thin so every time i film a video i have either my neighbors or my roommates or someone outside just making so much noise and i can never find a perfect time of day to film videos which is really frustrating so that in itself has been a problem. And of course, there are now YouTube shorts, which means I can just upload shorter videos when I'm being less active. I do obviously want to film a video like this so I can talk to all of you. I have really loved filming all these gay educational videos, but I've had so much backlash over filming these educational videos, even with YouTube themselves, because these topics can be seen as controversial. It did somewhat damage my channel and I no longer have monetization on my YouTube channel, which sucks, but it's, it's okay. It's annoying because I do want to film these videos, but when YouTube targets my channels and also takes down all my videos, it's really hard to continue. And yes, the monetization is a factor that was really annoying, but obviously I'm still going to continue filming videos. But even with that, I actually got a YouTube strike the other day and it's so annoying when I experience these things. Just to let you know, I got a YouTube strike on a video that was unlisted. I had never released a video. It was just a draft and it wasn't anything in the video. It was the links that I put in the video. I think it was a link to my OnlyFans because you can't put a direct link to your OnlyFans account. You can only do it for a link tree. So YouTube checked a video in my drafts from like two years ago and they gave me a strike for that, which is so, obsessing because it does feel like my channel's being targeted but at the end of the day i'm always going to post educational videos but I, yeah i just wanted to tell you that's why i took a little break there were many factors and i just haven't really been in the right mindset recently to film videos i haven't found the right time to film videos there's always people making so much noise i wanted to know which direction i wanted to take my channel in i do want to continue filming the educational videos but just so a lot of you know, like I said earlier, I have decided to leave Barcelona and I will be going to England for a couple of months, but then I'm actually going traveling with my friend across Asia. So I thought maybe I can do like some travel content as well. So it's gonna be really fun. What I'm going to do right now is film a couple videos just after I've done with this one. So if you guys are looking for some educational videos still and some, you know, some typical Stephen Brendan stuff, then stick around. Remember to subscribe because I'm planning to keep pushing out these videos no matter what comes at me. I'm gonna always post these videos because I know that they're helping a lot of people. But um, I definitely just want to continue posting so much tips because I look at all the videos that I used to post and they were from so long ago and I, you know, I had my different hairstyle as well. So it would be good to post a little update as well of what I'm currently looking like because everyone thinks I've still got my wave hairstyle and I don't, I'm sorry. <laughs> also, for those of you who are wondering, I did decide to shave the beard. I thought, you know what, I've had it for one month. That's enough. <laughs> enough chit chatter. I'm gonna start filming some videos, but I just wanted to have a little catch up. So other than that, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Remember to leave this video a big thumbs up as well. I'm also going to be doing a 
Q&A very soon or like a dirty questions Q&A or like a deep personal Q&A when we hit the next subscribers milestone. So get ready for that. Guys, I've missed you so much and I'm going to start filming now. So I hope you have an amazing day and stick around. Mwah.